Ladies and gentlemen, let's, I think we need some music for this. Let's see. You have think, your Zuckerman material as well there this in front it, of you. Yeah, I have it all. In U.S. News World Report, James Steyham. Is there a man who can save the party of Republicans from themselves? There may be one, but only one. His name is Michael Bloomberg. And he used to be a Republican and a Democrat before that. Now Bloomberg is an independent waiting to be asked to dance by a party that is taking American politics and values down. The 2016 field of candidates has been a summer circus, but we aren't laughing anymore at Donald Trump, Ben Carson, Ted Cruz, and the dark rhetoric they and others spew against the American traditions of immigration and religious tolerance. By the way, didn't Trump marry an immigrant woman once or twice? I thought so. I asked above if there was a man who could save the party. It's because Carly Fiorina and Sarah Palin are the best they can do. Those two mean girl ladies really take the cake and suggest what a woefully low opinion Republicans have of us. I'll say no more except Bloomberg is the man of reason to come to the aid of the party. It's from Jamie Steyer. Um, she is writing in the U.S. Uh, News World Report. So what we have is a suggestion that the only mm -hmm. man to take down the billionaire Donald Trump is the billionaire Michael Bloomberg, written about in U.S. News World Report, owned by the billionaire <laughs> Morton Zuckerman. Now, to be fair, we should do a running tally. Um, let's say Trump is really worth $9 billion. Some people say $3 billion. Either way, he's um, ahead of Mort Zuckerman, who's at $2.6 billion. But the reason why you praise a man like Michael Bloomberg is because he has $40 billion, ladies and gentlemen. So you see, the rest of us should all just sit in the sidelines and watch the billionaires sort this all out.